Hey, I'm Gabe, and you're watching SLTV. Hey. Check out what happened the last week. Springfield is in full on Christmas mode. I know. There's something so magical about seeing downtown all decked out. The twinkle lights. The festive wreaths. The garland on the lamppost. The mayor's Christmas tree in the middle of the square. Yeah, the mayor's tree lighting ceremony is a fun tradition. It's so cool that SLT was asked to be the opening number. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Roll, Roll the, the highlight, highlight reel. reel. Highlights of this week's was Cinderella. I know it was all like sweep the floor, close the door, sing to the birds, bibbidi bobbidi pumpkin carriage, mice turned into horses. I love you, Cinderella. I lost my shoe. I'll search every foot in the kingdom to find her. And they all lived happily ever after. The, the end. end. You know, we've been doing a lot of cool stuff that isn't making front page news. Oh really? Like what? Well, we started our school tour shows again. Oh yeah, that, the fairy tale show for the grade school students. Once upon a time, a captivating musical adventure. Yeah, what else? Well, story time Saturday, it's really cool too, featuring a new storyteller each month. Who came this month? Robbo, he read stories and he sang songs. There truly is something for everyone at SLT. Hi Grace. Hi Grace. Would you like to hear a joke? Sure. What did the left eye say to the right eye? What did the left eye say to the right eye? In between us, something smells. <laughs> Here's what's coming up at SLT. Gabe. Yeah? Do you think you could put in a good word for me with Santa? Well, I haven't really talked to him since last year, but what's going on? I was waiting in line at the mall and I got nervous and ran away. Ah, uh, mm-hmm, yep, classic. Don't worry, it happens to the best of us. So, you can talk to him for me. Have you heard of Zoom calls with Santa? You mean? That's right, it's a direct line from Santa's workshop to wherever you are. So I can get my whole family in the living room to Zoom call with Santa? Yeah, and he'll have a very personalized conversation with you. That's wonderful! Gabe, you saved Christmas! Oh, oh, oh. Do you think Rudolph and Superman are related? Ah, man, you gotta prepare me before you slap me with a brain muscle like that. Sorry, I just can't get it out of my head. Well, they can both fly. And Rudolph's nose glows. And Superman's eyes glow when he shoots laser beams. Do you think Rudolph can shoot laser beams out of his nose? Ah! I did it again, didn't I? Five, six, seven, eight, kapow, kacha! Jingle, jingle, jingle. Put on a star and bounce like Kris Kringle. Wrap the present. Cancel your plans. Big finish with fierce jazz hands. Auditions for Jazz Hands and Jingle Bells are coming up. I think we're ready. Five, six, seven, eight. I'm Mia and you're watching SLTV. Good morning, I'm Liza Gray. I'm the other teacher at the Academy of Fine and Performing Arts. I'm wearing my shades today because our students are so bright. Now you're gonna hear from Cadence and Jesse and they're gonna talk to you about how we integrate mathematics into our Poetic Portraits Unit of Study. Hi, my name is Cadence, and for my design challenge, I drew a car. We had an option to draw a something in nature, a car or a chair. I have an obtuse angle at the top of the car that is 110 degrees, a, another obtuse angle that is on the windshield that is 100 degrees, and a right angle that's 90 degrees at the bumper. Hi, I'm Jesse, and I had to do a design challenge as a test, and I chose a tree. This is my acute 45 degree angle. This is my obtuse 137 degree angle. And this is my right angle. Great job, Cadence and Jesse. I love how you shared how we assess in mathematics in our Poetic Portraits Unit of Study. I'm keeping my shades on because your futures are bright. Hi, Charlie. Hi, Gray. Can I tell you a joke? Sure. What is a turkey's favorite Thanksgiving food? I have no idea. Nothing. It's already stuffed. <laughs> Try this. I'm going to teach you how to remove an eggshell in mere seconds. First, you tap the top and get this shell off. Nice and clean. All right. And then that's off, nice and clean. And then you tap the bottom. 
and get the shell off nice and clean. You put your mouth around the egg, but you don't let any air out and you blow it out the bottom, all right? And sometimes it sticks in there and it doesn't work so great, but sometimes it's amazing. Cross your fingers, here we go. Wow, yeah, that was good enough. I have a little egg on my face. Ah, yolk's on me. Mm. Isn't that impressive? Your parents will be so proud. Great job, everybody. I hope that you were able to figure that out. I know it's a lot of fun. You are excellent people. If you do this trick, you'll really crack everybody up. <laughs> I wrote that myself. Um, hey, thanks so much, and uh, enjoy the egg trick. Good work. I'm Logan, and you're watching SLTV. Hi, my name is Emily and I work in the box office. Today we're going to talk about the boutique that's located in our theater. At the boutique you can buy all kinds of merchandise that's either show related, like wands for Cinderella or Shrek ears for Shrek, and really cool SLT merch. We also sell flowers that you can give to our actors and technicians at shows, and all of these are great gifts for that theater goer in your life. For any other questions, feel free to call the box office at 417-869-1334. Can't wait to see you at the show. Hi, I'm Grace. Hi, I'm Charlie. And you're watching SLTV. My name is Leda, and why, 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 why do you always have to <laughs> not be performing? <laughs> why, 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 why? I know, Leda. I want to always be performing, because it's the most fun ever. Um, but believe it or not, I haven't actually performed on stage in a play or a musical for a very long time, because I've been directing and choreographing and teaching. And when I'm not working on a show here at Springfield Little Theater, I'm doing a lot of things behind the scenes to help make this business run. So I might be meeting with a community member, or developing relationships, or helping with the marketing team, or planning programs, or budgeting, or preparing a board report. I know, doesn't that sound fun? Um, but when I'm not working for the theater, I love nature, I love reading, I love going to antique stores and flea markets, and just doing really quiet things. What do you like to do, Lita? And are you performing all the time? Hi, Grace. Hi, Charlie. Want to hear a joke? Yeah. How does, how does the ocean say goodbye? How, what? <laughs> It waves. 